Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jess and I'm a stay-at-home mom of two. Today's video is part grocery haul and part dinner. Apparently, I always do my intros on the couch now because when I'm filming the videos, I forget to do them. But oh well. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you do, don't forget to hit that like button and let's get to the video. Here's everything we got at HEB this week. This is mostly like a fill-in haul and a couple of dinners and just some things we were running out of. So for meat this week we just got a pack of chicken breasts. This is going to be for two dinners and then some extra to put in the freezer. We got some thick cut bacon. We're going to make some chicken bacon and Swiss sandwiches. We got some beef brisket sausage. We're gonna make a Cajun pasta thing. Some ground beef. I'm gonna make some... Hamburger pie. <laughs> it's like the impossible cheeseburger pie thing. My mom used to make that all the time when we were growing up and I haven't had it in forever. So we're gonna try that out. Don't lick the tape. I grabbed some green onion dip to snack on with chips. I wanted the yellow onion dip. Oh, I forgot we were out of this. I'm glad you remembered. I like my butter. Some tub butter for toast and stuff, and then some regular butter. Got some heavy whipping cream for the Cajun pasta. Some biscuits just to have in the fridge. We also got vanilla and strawberry yogurt for the boys. Excuse me, Angus. Dad wanted vanilla strawberry. No one would get it for me. Vanilla strawberry? Mm -hmm. Strawberry vanilla? It doesn't exist. I'm Mix them together. I was joking. <laughs> That's why. I was joking. That's Some cheddar cheese good. for the cheeseburger pie. <clears throat> Swiss cheese for our sandwiches. Parmesan for the Cajun pasta. And then this parmesan for salads and whatever else. Excuse me. Move. <laughs> we got some corn on the cob to go on the side with some chicken and gravy I'm gonna make. We got a big yellow watermelon. It was expensive, but me and Garrett really wanted it. And I made sure I found the one with the big orange spot. That's what you're supposed to do, right? Or the yellow spot. It's all yellow. That means it sat there and ripened more so it's sweeter. Sure, let's That's what I've that. always heard. Yeah. One big cucumber. <laughs> He's like, what'd you give me? Some romaine hearts for salads and some bananas. <laughs> Your favorite thing. Did we ever put was that like on the video when we were making it? I don't think so. One time Adam left a whole can of spam on the cutting board out of the can and the dog stole the entire thing. I'm surprised he didn't get sick. Not the dogs. The, the dog, Angus. The dog. <laughs> the dog. The dog. The big dog. All right, we got some more sodas. Got the orange burst this time and then Garrett picked out the Kool-Aid Pool-Aid again. I was gonna get them some of the Capri Sun waters but the whole shelf was empty. Is there like a shortage on Capri Suns or what? I don't know what's going on. There's there was like, zero. There's like, oh, you can only get two orders of chicken or two things of wings and... We got some more granola bars because our basket was finally running low. I haven't bought these in a while. I just got the mixed box. They picked out some strawberry Pop-Tarts. Daddy's favorite. <laughs> we got some peach fruit cups that fell out while they were going on the belt. Some chocolate chip. What are they Graham called? Crackers. I was going to say Teddy Grahams, Buddy Grahams. Some Bisquick for the cheeseburger pie thing. My brain's not working. I'm hungry. I don't think I've ever bought Bisquick. I haven't bought it since, like, we lived in the duplex. No, like when we first got married. That's the last time I bought Bisquick. Got some more ketchup. We should have gotten two. Remember we said that last time because we always run out. Some more apple cider vinegar that we were out of. Some strawberry applesauce. 
some more of the boys' and dads' favorite salad dressing. And when you bought that, you got croutons free. So we grabbed the cheese and garlic ones. We got some bacon spam because pork isn't good enough without some pork added into it. So we're going to try that one. I'm just going to eat it. So, like, can we eat it now? I'm starving. Fry it up and eat it. Some or pizza you know goldfish. I'm going to fry it up and put it in my ramen. Oh, yeah. So we should include those in the haul. Uh, <laughs> Garrett wanted some Vienna sausages, so we grabbed two of those. Bacon bits for salad. And then brown gravy and chicken gravy to make my chicken and gravy. <laughs> for chips, I got some regular rich potato chips to go with that green onion dip I got. Garrett picked out taco Doritos. And Adam is going to regret these. He picked out these ghost pepper chips. Are the, is that the same brand that did like the one chip thing? Yes. So they're going to be really hot. I'm not even going to try that. Those are all you. Loaf of bread for sandwiches. Some cavatappi. Is that <laughs> Some corkscrew pasta for... Some twirly stuff. <laughs> for... What's it for? The A Cajun pasta. Huh? Cajun pasta. That's Cajun. A bag of potatoes and some hamburger buns. Seated. Now, who wants to see Adam try a hot chip? Let me smell them. Hey. Warning. They're freaking hot. Freaking hot. <laughs> I guarantee you they're not that freaking hot. They don't even look like they have stuff on them. They just smell like Doritos. It's a trick. It's a little bitty bag, too. I mean, a huge bag, and there's barely anything in it. That's because you can only eat like two before your face melts off. No. Wait for it. There's no flavor. <laughs> Are you okay? <clears throat> <laughs> Pretty hot. It tastes like a pepper. Like a crunchy pepper. Like what kind of pepper? A straight up hot I, I, pepper. I'm guessing you've never just eaten a ghost pepper. I'm guessing. I don't want it. Is it hotter than that scorpion sauce you got? No? I'm not even going to try it. No, these aren't that hot. Make sure the boys don't get into those. And I thought I'd include these. Adam got these on Amazon because we don't have any stores that carry them around here. And he wanted to try them, so we get to try 30 of them. Is that how many there were? Yeah. 30 packs of this ramen that is supposed to be really, really good. And I'm about to eat one because I'm hungry. Well, no, I'm not. Now it's too close to dinner. Yeah. No, I'm not trying those. So we have to eat 30 packs of ramen now. I'm sure that won't be a problem. I guess I'm going to have to order the hot chip online. Try it. So that's everything we got at HEB this week, and here's the total on the screen. Mm. Not bad? It's not that hot, you sure? No, I'm not trying those. So here's my super not fancy meal plan for, we just did four dinners until Adam's off work again. So we're going to do the impossible cheeseburger pie with a salad on the side. And then I'm going to make some chicken and gravy in the crock pot. And we'll just have that with mashed potatoes and the corn on the cob. And then I'm going to make the Cajun sausage pasta thing and then I might make some cheddar garlic biscuits on the side and then we're gonna have some chicken bacon and Swiss sandwiches with some curly fries that we already had in the freezer that's why they put all that stuff in that mixtures and stuff you don't have any chemicals in there to keep it fresh I mean it's some but it's, <laughs> it's plumped up so for the impossible cheeseburger pie the real recipe says to put onion in it but this guy doesn't like that I've never been a ground beef and onion dude. So he's seasoning it like he does. I can't his believe we have to do this. I need to get more seasoning secret. With his secret clumpy seasoning and minced garlic. So some of that mix, some minced garlic, and a pound of ground beef. Why didn't you just put the seasoning in the pan with the meat? I don't know, because I forgot I wasn't making hamburgers. <laughs>
I don't know so why. You, got, you used that. my mix bowl. You got well, it dirty see, for nothing. See, now when you do it, it's, it's all in there, so. Alright, so stove top. Not the stuffing. <laughs> I remembered you saying you didn't like it, and I hope not. Well, like, does that seem right? You got it. It's liquid. Can you look it up on your phone real quick? Hey, crackers? Yeah. Oh, that's why it's good. Whoa! Up. You want a cheetah. Now it's going to be lumpy because I did the drink back. or the lid. Yeah, just yeah, like Betty yeah. Crocker. <laughs> Original biscuit mix. That's the problem. It's the same thing. A cup of milk and two eggs. Alright, I got it right. Good. Okay. When, yeah, it's pretty stinking liquidy. I mean, from the picture, but the picture could be wrong. Beef. So what's for dinner? Oh, that was lean, baby. You didn't even have to drain it. You wanted all that in your pie? Oh, I like some oily pie. Adam just informed me that I've been doing this wrong the entire time. Unless I'm wrong, but I don't think so. I mean, I always wondered why it had a pour spout on it. Yeah, I always so take the basket have, out so you can spin like it. this and then just dump out what's in there. So you can spin it and dump it and spin it and dump but it. But you can spin it and dump it. And dump it. I, I, I feel it. very smart right now. <laughs> so is this enough for dinner? I hope so. Yeah. So one of these feeds us. Well, actually, that was a smaller one. Yeah, so that's three salads right there. Yeah. Cool. So for toppings, we have some chopped up onions, ketchup and mustard. You might want to get the other ketchup out. Yeah. Jalapenos, pickles, and a little bit of lettuce if anybody wants lettuce on their burger pie. And then for our salad, we have some Parmesan cheese. Bacon bits, some cheese and garlic croutons, ranch dressing, and everyone else's favorite. That is really good. And then some black olives.
as always, thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to hit that like button. And if you haven't already, we'd love for you to join our YouTube family. So hit that subscribe button down below and turn on notifications. And we'll see you guys in the next one.